the projects, the work you're going to see today is really brand new. So we made an interactive pivot table. My concept is called Delve. I built a data visualization application. We were excited about a few possibilities. We had a application process where people would propose projects with the Lampix and Bloomberg environment and came up with our selection of five groups. From that point it was basically six weeks of regular meetings. But now what does augmented reality mean for the office? We now call it Data Touch. You put in a physical document, a paper document, that has tabular data on it. It will then be extracted by the application and visualized using Lampic's uh, projector. I really love augmented reality because it's kind of the intersection between the analog and the digital. A paper document that, yes, was printed last week, but you can still have all of the data in real time as it's happening. The way that I like to view and think of augmented reality is as added reality. The concept that I came up with is uh, called Delve, and it is a tool that can be used by analysts during their research processes, and they have a text that they're reading. They can project it onto their desks and using a dry erase pen, they can highlight things directly on their desk and that will pull into a note that they can then search for and see all of their highlights in one place later. In a business like finance um, and any enterprise business, time is valuable. Any way that you can help people expedite those processes of finding insights is uh, really helpful for the business. We wanted to think about Lambix as an opportunity to improve collaboration. Through the iterative process and sort of brainstorming where to start, we decided with pivot tables. We wanted to bring physical interaction to the pivot table experience, so we used physical objects that you can use to manipulate the field and see how that would change the experience from being on screen. Instead of just looking at a sheet, you're able to sort of start from a place and then branch off from there and find new trends in the data. Well, we learned that Bloomberg is doing a lot of different types of innovation and this is just one one of the areas that they're exploring. Yeah, I think that they definitely seem to put a large amount of emphasis on like discoverability and play throughout their process, which makes them unique in the financial services realm. We live in a world where a lot of the physical objects are lifeless. What AR promises to do is to really give an enduring life to all these products after they're built and after they're created. I think within the next two to four years, we're gonna see some kind of AR in the enterprise.